guys, so I just want to share with you all what I do to uh, maintain my straight hair and what I do to it before I go to bed. So before I get started, I want to share with you all something I'm really, really, really excited about, and that is my trim. As you can tell, it's not hanging as much. I did get it um, a couple of inches taken off last night. Not that much or anything, nothing too dramatic, but... Um, this is not a link check, by the way, and this is like a really bad angle, but hopefully you can get the point of it. Um, it's like right at the bottom of my bra strap, and whereas before it was more like way like past my bra strap and like, like I guess close to my waist basically. I was in desperate need of a trim and just got really tired and I really didn't want to do it at first, but then I was just like, you know what, my hair looks raggedy. It looks so raggedy, so I'm just gonna go ahead and trim it, and I'm so happy with it. Like now, I can go through minus that. <laughs> I need to detangle my hair, but I can actually comb through my hair with my fingers, and my hands will not get caught on my hair. What I like to do um, to moisturize my hair is I actually use hair grease, and hair grease actually will moisturize my hair and keep my hair moisturized. This is the uh, Proclaim Coconut Hair Conditioner. I got this from Sally's. Of course, you can get it from your beauty supply store or whatever. And I just take a little bit and I put it all throughout my hair. And I don't grease my scalp or anything like that because I just don't see the point of that. But um, I put it all throughout my hair. And what this does is it will weigh it down, which is what I want because what happens is when I go to bed, I like to bun my hair up, kind of like in a one big old bantu knot. And then the next morning, my hair will be, will form like these amazing little, or big curls and waves and stuff. And the grease really helps to keep that. So, yeah. And I also like using hair grease um, on my edges, cause that will help keep those laying down nicely and all that. So then I'm just gonna kind of comb that stuff through. Okay, so then I take my hair and I'm just gonna keep that part in there because that's usually how I like to wear my hair when it's down. And I pull it into a ponytail. I like to do this every single night before I go to bed because it really makes a difference. I may not apply product every night, but I definitely always will bun it. And I would say, um, for those of you all <laughs> who are worried about like, um, this is what my hair looks like, Ponto. If you're worried about your hair stinking, definitely don't apply product every single day. I don't, <laughs> for that main reason. What I do is I try and get it up kind of high. After I have my um, ponytail where I want it, I try and go kind of like in the middle top part of my hair. I just wrap it around my fingers. And as I'm wrapping it around, I'm doing a really tight bun. And then I put it my ponytail holder on like that. All right, hey guys, so I just finished doing a um, updated foundation and eyebrow tutorial. If you're interested in seeing that video, you can click right here and you can see that video. Um, but I just want to show you all what my hair looks like the next day after I take it down. Well, this is actually the next, next day. I didn't get a chance to film yesterday because I was running late for work, but this is what um, oops, the like big bantu knot bun thing looks like. As you can tell, it's wavy. Uh, I have noticed that <laughs> with my because I got my trim, it does look a little bit different. Um, like it doesn't last as long, so I probably would just have to use some hairspray. 
And the hairspray that I like to use is the Aussie Instant Freeze hairspray and this actually works on black hair so I don't think it doesn't. I use just a little bit of this stuff and my hair will actually, like my curls and stuff will actually last all day long. Um, and that's the same stuff that I use with my hot rollers which I'm going to be doing a tutorial on later on this week but as you can tell this is what it looks like. side I always have to fix do a little scrunching all that I usually just throw that over my shoulder anyway so it doesn't even matter but um so yeah that's pretty much it and I hope you guys like this video and I'll talk to you guys later bye